The images are burned into our memories, the terror, the heartache. And for students, it hits way too close to home. I was pretty sad, so, yeah, because it could happen to anybody. It's cliche, but that'll never happen here. It can never happen in the state of Ohio. Uh, and it's disbelief. Students and faculty at Horizon Science Academy on Morse Road will likely never meet students from Chardon. But for them, it doesn't matter. They knew they had to do something. It was important because we wanted to show our support because what they're going through is pretty rough. One of the questions that continued to pop up was, what can we do to help? Uh, a few teachers had mentioned about the nationwide and statewide movement to wear red in support of Chardon, and we thought that would be an excellent idea. Wearing red was just the start. This morning, they gathered around the school flagpole, signing cards and posing for pictures. Small gestures for a community dealing with overwhelming grief. Pride goes through your mind. I mean, it's, it's exciting to see a, a group of young people, middle schoolers, have such a, a good grasp of what's going on in the world today. and and to have them understand the magnitude of what's happening here and, and the importance to show support and reach out. They know this heartache won't go away anytime soon, but they want the students, the faculty, really the entire Chardon community to know they are not alone. Central Ohio grieves for them too. I tell them that everything will be all right because between every dark tunnel, there's always a light. Marcus Thorpe, NBC4.